Welcome to the foundation, rookies. I'm Dr. Raymond Ham, and this ends the first class of our employee <laughs> induction program. Training course has ended. Please add your comments. Okay, before we add the comments. That was wild! <laughs> oh yeah, save that add-on. I can't pick up my time out here. Okay, sure thing. Whatever it makes it easier. Can you put me in timeout? Uh, maybe you need it. But... I didn't just accidentally timeout I love, did I? I don't know. It feels like they want to be timed out. But... This is very special. Oh, this is very special. It's very unique, especially to the SCP format, at least to me. The course was arranged appropriately. I think it was arranged appropriately. He sounded qualified. The connection was smooth. You know what? Five stars. Uh, I only saw a Boy Scout instructor scaring a rookie. Don't really feel anything good. It helped me realize if I don't strictly abide by the rules, I could be injected with an aesthetics and sent home with Jonathan. <laughs> I'm gonna send that one. What the fuck's going on in the chat? <laughs> All right, let's see what the group chat's talking about. Hi, girl. How'd it feel? To be honest, I feel like kind of Just be honest. Hey, buddy, don't throw up on the floor. Stop messing with him, Stuart. Carl, that was only the beginning. You gotta learn to get used to it. Live with it. I got it. And... Everyone here wants to teach you something, Carl. Live with it. Come on, Stuart. Thank you. I feel much better. In any case... You're welcome to join us, Carl. Past hours been torture. I don't know how the others managed to hold on. Messed up during training session. I jumped off a cliff, fell into the icy water, and choked hard. What? The river is also real. I feel taste in my mouth now. The foul taste of the river water. In any case, this is my first day at the foundation. I got the cafeteria and get something to eat. Maybe I'll make my stomach feel better. What the fuck? Okay. <laughs> The cafeteria. Uh, uh. I, I still haven't encountered what I actually played. <laughs> so I can click on some of these, right? This is the Florida. A bill has been approved in Florida recently, allowing citizens to attack others with electronic devices. The bill has caused many violent incidents to occur. Perpetrators have used electronic devices such as phones, laptop game consoles to attack passers by randomly. Now, this incident is confirmed to be influenced by SCP-1434 and MTF was sent it. Huh. It is reported that a series of incidents have resulted in economic loss of $6.72 million on 68 citizens in Georgia. Huh. What a bizarre SCP. Small Mantis Big Trouble, a mass protest organized by Leafer Mantis, have broken out in surrounding areas of Site 87. These insects, which are only active in autumn, abnormally gathered together to protest against the massive deployment plan proposed by the Wisconsin government because this behavior will prevent them from appreciating autumn leaves. It is purported that the director of Site 87 has already requested local government to suspend defoliating. What? Site 93 confirms the existence of multiverse using one of the anomalies at their disposal. This is a breakthrough that would definitely be useful in case of K-class scenarios. Keter? Unless the K-class scenario destroys the multiverse. Ooh. They can... They get, whoever's at this site could use some grammar. Interesting fact, there could be another you reading this article right now. Say hello to your parallel self. Site 13. An abnormal incident occurred within Site-13. All buildings within Site-13 disappeared in no reason. 
and many corrupted unknown buildings appeared out of nowhere. Part of these buildings were in fire or in purring. Blank hours later, the site was back to normal with blank personnel, including director missing. SCP blank 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 and SCP blank 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 disappeared during the incident. Huh. So we got it. Gint. Got it. Do it. Got it, boss. And me? Hey, Chuck. I'm going to be in signed field work again. Gent. What the hell? Something went wrong at Site 74. Personnel from our other apartments went to for it, so we need to take on more field work. Just like I said, our apartment should be renamed to Relief, Relief Station. Stop complaining, Gent. Carl, how do you feel now? Ready for a new job? Good. Here's your first mission, Carl. Review the archives and organize them according to the requirements. Do not underestimate the task at hand. Go and finish it. I'll do my best. Good luck, Carl. Just one thing, MIT boy. Strictly follow the regulations and do not act on your own without authorization. Thanks, I got it. Managing our first mission. Well, 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 dub dub. All right, let's move. Some someone in development for this game must really like. All right, let's go to the files. Today's mission. All right, finally at my job now. Enter data regarding the investigation reports into the archive system on the right. Click test. Top of that. Click text with red underline. After clicking, the data dragging effect will be activated. <laughs> Drag it to the archive system on the right. Oh, okay. Left click to release the data. Data will be uploaded automatically after entering all data into the archive system. Click submit to complete the task. Okay. <clears throat> I'm Agent Q from the Accident Investigation Department. Containment breach occurred at Pony Station and contact with the Foundation has been lost. Agent Bella Lawrence was given orders to enter there Pony Station and retrieve the black box. <laughs> Following is a transcript of the interview with Bella Lawrence. <laughs> Oh my god. This is what I played. I played this part. I played this part at GCX. I played this part. I remember. I played this part. I remember playing it in the beta too. The drugs seem to be taking effect. Go ahead and ask questions. I can't be certain how long she'll stay away from. I remember this. Sparrow. Sparrow. <laughs> can I submit a game request, Mr. Dominar? <laughs> sure. You were assigned to retrieve the black box. Out with it. Where is the black box? Huh? Uh, I... I brought it back. Why is your name Mr. Demi Robux, please? No, box nothing. Box. I don't, think don't Robux. lie to us. You never brought it back. No. That that's impossible. I remember. Oh, I'm I getting deja vu. Completed my assigned task. Oh, I'm getting deja vu about I, deja vu. I swear. Ouch! All right. In my ear. Oh, it's crawling inside my ear. We're not here to lay blame or point any fingers. I'm not a Roblox guy. I'm sorry. 
My name is Mr. Dominari. Because Dominari is Latin. Bella, I'm and I stuck with it. I'm sorry to have to bother you in such a state, but it is critical that we find that black box. We need to know what happened at Pony Station. My, my memory's a mess at the moment. That's fine. We'll take it slowly. Step by step. Why don't we start from the moment you received your mission? Tell us what you remember. I'll try. Hmm. That night. Oh God, this part was spooky. For Pony Station, we'll arrive in about three minutes. Very good, Sparrow. It's been forty-eight hours since the Foundation lost contact with Pony Station. SCP-701 experiments there have been ongoing. We have reason to suspect a containment breach. Fuck. What is my mission? According to Foundation security regulation 709S, each site must have a black box placed in a secure area to assist in identifying the cause of an accident, should one occur. Oof. Your task is to investigate the situation and retrieve the black box. Black box? Got it. Easy enough. Okay, I've arrived. What does it stand for? Dominari um, stands for overcoming something. That's what it stands for. Dominari stands for overcoming. Um, the direct translation is actually dominate or dominating over something. Why are you telling me a sprint? I'm able to observe the mission site from here. But it doesn't seem like one of the Foundation's secure facilities. Pony oh, Station, water. officially known as Site 74, was originally a hydroelectric power station. After it was abandoned, the Foundation repurposed it as one of their sites. Initially, it was used only to contain a few safe level anomalies. But recently, it's also taken over SCP 701. I don't know all the details. We won't know the truth until you retrieve the black box. Got it. I'll complete the task as instructed and retrieve the black box. Cool. Why'd you put Mr. Why not Whimsical Dominari? I don't know. I like the sound of Mr. Dominari. I'm pretty sure there's a deer jump scare here. Yep. I remember that deer. You can't scare me. It scared me twice already. I remember the deer. I remember playing this level. I remember it all. Yep, I remember being like, what the fuck is all this about? Oh my god, I don't remember these though. I remember using them, I don't remember why. Yep. Okay. This is the objective of the mission. Alright. Yep, I know how to crouch. Ah, oh, shit. We have the site now. I've just entered Pony Station. Retrieve the black box from the lab. Room 705. The seventh floor. Sparrow. Must. What's that? Bald Eagle. You're cutting out. This is out of the safe range. Whispering in my ear. Whoa, that's cool as fuck. Much better. Now let's find that elevator. Oh my god! Oh my god. <sighs> I knew that scare was a thing. I don't 
thanks for the coin. <laughs> I knew that that scare was a thing. And yet, I still let it scare me. Oh my god, that's terrifying. Tyler Cooper, today I read George Thompson's research log for SCP-701. Could it be true? Has he really been performing comparison experiments on chimpanzees this whole time? What could he have planned? Does he not realize what he's up against? The whole thing is turning out to be an ungodly mess. It's now abundantly clear why the Foundation transferred him out of Pony Station, leaving me to take over his post. He was performing the experiment all wrong. The whole direction of the project was all wrong. SCP-701 holds great potential. I still believe that. I will have to adopt a new method of study. Efficient, fast, direct. It all begins Dr. tomorrow. Tyler Cooper. I've heard of this guy. A bit of an eccentric and a thrill seeker. Do you relegate? Regulation, sorry. I thought I heard something. All personnel on duty shall not leave early. Absence from work is strictly prohibited. Personnel who cannot be on duty due to special circumstances shall promptly coordinate with the relevant site director. All personnel, all personnel, sorry, shall strictly comply with the prescribed regulations and rules pertaining to the access of classified files. All personnel on duty shall fill in the inspection form truthfully and correctly. If a situation that cannot be handled independently should arise, personnel must immediately report the incident. Spare key to room 101 placed under the flower pot in the visitor's lobby. If used, please play right now. Spare key. You know what? Oh. Oh! Spare key to key 101? Well, oh, that's very convenient that I know exactly where that key is. The visitor's lobby. This isn't creepy at all. Alright. What's that sound? Okay, so one key was in that flower pot. Alright, consider me freaked out. Seating request form. A setting request form. I'm so fucking stupid. Hmm. All the plans, including the project schedule that follows, have been disrupted. The actors of the whole site is theirs. They managed to procure a goddamn script from God knows where, and they've taken over my laboratory accordingly. And Dr. Cooper, or whatever his name is, in particular, he puts on airs every time the operation starts as if everyone should listen to him. Who does he think he is? I have to let him know who's the boss around here. Do you hear? I want to check these. Why did you do that? Spare key with 101 written on it. Perfect. Too easy. So, in this level, <laughs> I know there's a, th a certain thing that happens, and it deals with these mannequins. I'm not sure if this is the exact mannequin. But they start to follow you around and shit, and I hate it. Oh, I hate it so much. I, oh my god, I really hate it. Whoa. I know it's an SCP and everything, too. But still. I know it happens. I know it. Yep. This is where it begins. I don't fuck with mannequins, man. Oh my god. Oh my god. I'm not okay right now. I just don't fuck with faceless shit like that. I can't stand the lack of a face.
What's the sound? Even though I played this level, don't don't get it twisted. Does not mean I'm good at it. Or remember it in any good way. Hey bud. I see you. Blue fire. Yep, disappeared. Yep, disappeared. Yep, disappeared. Fuck! Dude, I'm just not okay right now. <sighs> Purchasing list. Multimeter, maintenance kit, wire cutters, arc lamp. Oh, I see those two dudes right there. Hey guys. Ah, I'm just gonna leave it be. This must be the elevator. To the seventh floor, then. We'll hold the phone. Let's fuck around in this room for a second. I'm sure there, there is important things to be had here. What we offered. The hanged king we served. I serve my king with my blood. Blissful suffocation. Sacrifice of sin. What's this? Some kind of poem? Ah, my head! Ah! Cognito hazard. I know what a cognito hazard is. Oh, E. Oh, I need to click it. Ah, oh, that's cool. I know what a cognito hazard is. familiar with cognito hazards. I've been trained to deal with them. But this wasn't anything like that. I couldn't breathe. It was like there was a knot tied around my throat. I was weightless, hanging, gasping. No matter how much I struggled, nothing helped. That does sound terrifying. But perhaps it was just a nightmare, though. No. We wake up from nightmares, not from this. Oh my god. Are you kidding me? These fucking mannequins. Okay. I guess I'm taking the stairs. It's nope, just fucking kidding. You're not taking the stairs. Yep, those guys are gone now. We're gonna start moving around. Oh my god! Oh my god! What the? Uh, okay. I remember that. I remember that. I remember it. I do. Don't exactly remember this though.
Dude, I'm sorry. I'm like... Oh, hi. Oh, I'm not doing okay right now, Ace. Isabella, if the lies of the monarchy would be recorded in a book, the archivist would never know a moment's rest. It would evidently become overburdened with fatigue. Maid Beatrice, Empress Lord Antonio is here. Isabella, what is that you say, my strange son? Already come to see me in the covenant. Go get me my very best dress at once and prepare a glass of poisoned wine. May Beatrice, as you say. May Beatrice leaves. Isabella, what sad truth the dice rolls with lies and bears with my name. And the martyr under this conspiracy shares my own flesh and blood. What does this keep saying? Lord of Aligada or something? Oh my god, I hate it all. I'm not having a fun time anymore. This is killing me. <laughs> nope. I'll just go up. No, thank you. Doesn't this break or something? I remember climbing these vents. Could it have something to do with SCP-701? The situation here is much more serious than I expected. I remember this area. I guess I'll fuck around with it. Hey, bud. Miss Irene Mabel, recently former assistant of Dr. Tyler Cooper, Miss Lisa Amanda, was demoted because of her refusal to care at the experimental orders given by Dr. Cooper. On the 16th of oh, she was ejected with Class A amnestics and sent away from sight. To fill this role at the behest of Dr. Cooper himself, site management has decided to promote you to the role of senior experimental assistant. Your interview and authorization session will be held today at 1300 hours, 1330 hours, sorry. From 7-Eleven. Prepared. Huh. Look at that motherfucker. <laughs> ah! More script. Act 2! <laughs> Cover up the truth. Gonzalo orders the arrest of three men who witnessed the Queen's confession and imprisoned the Queen and the Covenant. Gonzalo then goes to have a secret meeting with Ambassador Alagada. Wait, is that what it said on the... On the wall, Lord of Alagada. After learning the Queen's captivity, Antonio begins to plot his revenge. <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? Please never do that again. Okay, if I take this from you, my friend. Act 3! <laughs> Gonzalo kills an eyewitness and orders the royal chef to make a stew from his body. The witness's daughter, Alinda, is then placed in the covenant. Antonio and his squire into the covenant. Not the covenant, sorry, convent. To confront the queen. She tries to kill Antonio, but he sees through her plan. She is left to suffer the consequences. As Antonio and his squire evacuate the monastery, they encounter the imprisoned Alinda. Fuck you. Oh, I hate it all. Oh, I hate it all so much. It's all very unusual these days. Many people have come to the site, <sighs> but they haven't registered with the authorities. I've heard that Cooper and his team are rehearsing the script into a play, and that all participants are required to record their daily status. My experiment has to be put on hold huh. because there's no one left to work on it. It's not right. I'll write an email to the minister and inform him of the malpractice going on here. Who's that? Oh. <laughs> oh, well. 
Hanged King's Tragedy. Archive SCP-701, is that what it says? fucking wood. God damn it. I know what you want, though. You want it to be moved? Oh god. Please move it. Perfect. Oh god. Okay, I mean, I can move it a little more. Alright. That should be good. Alright. Alright. So beyond this point, I actually don't remember a lot of what happened after this part. I don't. I only sat in the game for like 20, 30 minutes in GCX. And whenever I downloaded the beta afterwards, it was only a tiny bit. At most, oh, sorry, at first, most of the on-site personnel were apprehensive about participating in this project, but after just Distributing some SCP-701 documents to a few volunteers, they became widely circulated. The number of people coming to sign up suddenly increased. It's rather curious how it happened, and I haven't quite figured out the reason behind it yet, but it's welcome news. I'll take it as a good omen. Now I've managed to mobilize the entire station to participate every single person. It's my chance to prove myself an opportunity like this doesn't come every day. Why would Dr. Cooper need so many volunteers? And what on earth is this SCP-701? Is it this the play? Like, it seems like they're, they're just, like, convincing people to go on with this play. That's what I'm getting from it. Hmm. Oh my god, that was terrifying. Please stop. to get me to the seventh floor okay yeah i don't remember any of this anymore you know what? i'm just gonna go where she wants me to go seventh floor where are we at four ah. okay so going down makes me go up yeah so five Herschel notice. Hanged King's tragedy. Sacrifice everything with Herschel notice. Herschel notice? What the hell is going on here? Fourth floor again? What the fuck? Hmm. The way out of here might have something to do with these clocks. Heh. <laughs> what? Oh, what the hell? That's the fourth again down there. Oh my god, this is gonna be confusing. It says a red clock, a yellow clock, and I'm guessing... A blue clock? Stop talking to me. Hold 
Okay, it looks like nine is the right place for that one to be, though. Maybe I just have to, like, rotate them until I hear the ding. If that's the case, I just need to start playing with these. Like a safe, I guess. Nine, two. Okay. Nine to twelve. Showtime. Oh, I oh, You had my attention and now you have my interest. I'm actually a little bit more invested in this. It's no longer scary for scary's sake. Very sharp, but it still works. Oh, my God, what boy? I serve my king with my blood. Bless me, suffocation, tell us what it's saying. No, 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 what the hell. Are you feeling better now? S suffocation, like a rope, looped around my neck, pulling tight, weightless, hanging, nothing around me, just my feet dangling, struggling, fighting. It will swallow me and make me its slave. Bella, you are completely safe here. Nothing can hurt you. Okay, let's continue. <laughs> the situation there was much worse than expected. Much worse. I knew I had to get in touch with the Foundation. Uh, I managed to find a phone, and I called her back up. Oh god, it's still going. This is Sparrow, 09868, for Bald Eagle. I'm Hopefully it's not a phone. station on the seventh floor. The situation here is much worse than expected. I need backup. Bella, are you sure this is actually what happened? What do you mean? Yes, of course I'm sure. Come on, Bella. Try and focus. What are you talking about? Bella. You never made that phone call. I... Of course I... What? I... Pony Station was completely cut off. There was no contact with the outside world whatsoever. A phone call? That would have been impossible. No! I... But... I saw... What did you smell? Tell us what you saw. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what the actual hell? It's my time to go, is what it is. Oh my god, 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 oh my god. Go, 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 what are you waiting for? Oh my god! When attacked by an unknown source, it's right. It's wise to run. Well, no shit, Sherlock. I was running. I was running. I was running. That's all I was doing was running. Come on! It's right behind me. Oh, come on!
What's up, you fucking weirdos over there? Oh, what the hell? Looks like something bad happened here. <laughs> Thanks, Bella. Something over there. Oh, Jesus. Hold on. Oh, no, 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 no. The experimental report. Where is it? Okay. Okay, whatever. Object class and classified. Description this experiment was a multi object project including SCP blank, SCP blank, and SCP blank. The experiment primarily focused on researching the process of reality distortion led by George Thompson. The project lasted for a duration of five days. During the first three days, two Rorschach tests were conducted on SCP blank and blank. A level three hypnosis experiment was also conducted on the on three level D personnel influenced by SCP blank within a short period of time, the experimental subjects revealed varying degrees of immersion state. And on the fourth day, claimed being in a primary forest. The trees here are mainly Sequoia and Pinus Carabia. On the same day, the hume level of the surrounding environment was decreased to 37. Oh my god, this is, this is so much of nothing. <laughs> On the fifth day, the described scene began to invade reality. Uh, causing the ex original experiment site and six experimental subjects go missing. The project will force be suspended. Hmm. Sounds like a lot of hoopla. The explanation on that kind of. What the hell? We're evacuating. After the show, everyone went crazy. Really? Some hacked themselves. Some killed each other like beasts. That damn evil white monster. This was all destined to happen when he brought in that script. Everything that happened here is all Cooper's fault. It's their fault! This will be the last recording from the experiment. The hydropower plant will shut down forever. And no doubt my experiment will also... Oh, there he goes. We seem to know what happened to him. Let's fuck around over here, I guess. I saw you guys. Look at this. I'll be right out. <laughs> That Black Rattel squad? Is that what it's called? Black Rattel? Incident clipping 2. April 27th, local time. Five students were involved in a collective blank incident at the Cleveland Institute of Arts Drama Club in Ohio. Mmm, and another faculty member died of stab rooms. A janitor was taken into custody as suspect. The incident statement mentioned that four students used the blank from the ceiling during rehearsals. This was then repeated by the last remaining person that they assaulted the teacher. The teacher died two hours later. Following a forensic investigation of the scene, it was determined that the janitor had no clear motive for committing the crime. He's currently undergoing further observation in a psychiatric hospital. Oh, this is all sad. Oh, the lights are back on. And those guys are gone. Day 27? I didn't even check this. SCP-701 skips have been out for a week now, and the participants have had minor rehearsals, as described above. One thing continues to baffle me. They always seem to recite the wrong lines. Every single person, it's strange. Almost like it's orchestrated, and when I try to correct them, they become offensive, insisting that they read the correct that they read the correct line. But other than that minor hiccup, everything else went well. Very much looking forward to the first full rehearsal in room 705 the day after next. 
Okay, after the full rehearsal, all of our witness to the potential of SCP-701 in my name would become synonymous with the tally keeper, the genius behind the experiment, meant to, keep, to tap its endless potential. It's history in the making. Play? What is up with this SCP-701 experiment? I got no clue. I don't know what is up with it. This isn't creepy at all. Okay. Yep. This is all very new territory. So we'll put down, put down a little thing. This is reminding me of like that old CSP game a tiny bit. Only a tiny bit. Look at all this. Oh, okay. I see the the tech. At the banquet. Antonio bursts in and confirms Gonzalo's murderous crime as well as some lineage. Gonzalo is deposed by an angry group of ministers instead of killing Gonzalo, telling our exiles into the con convent. Sorry. Antonio then orders his squire to plan his way to Melinda. Play ends with a dance by a group of courtiers. This is all so bizarre. Secret over here. Nope. Just you guys flailing and falling about. Wait, you guys are getting back up? Like, look. I could have sworn I thought they were getting back up. Why does it look like they're all going to the same place? They are getting back up. Just kidding, not anymore. Oh shit, play. And they're all back up. Okay, see ya. Oh, this seems like. Oh, this seems very climatic. Oh fuck. <laughs> I'm a little spooked. Just a tiny bit scared of what might happen here. Won't lie. The black box. Oh, the black box. Can I take a seat? Oh god, okay, at least I'm like, oh god, okay. 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 Let's go. Let's go. We have black box. We just need to leave. Eighth floor. I mean, that is the whole plan, right? We have everything. Whoa. Handmade doll. Well constructed handmade doll with attack SCP 049. I just got a. Achievement called I Am the Cure. I'm pretty sure that's what it said. That's cute. Adorable. That looked like a place that you could hide shit. Okay. Again, this seems very climatic. <laughs> I'm pretty sure we're at the end of this little part. Hold on, guys. Okay, you know what? 
I've encountered scarier. This was where it began. Elevator closed, us going down, black box in hand. We look down at it, right? We go, oh, black in a box. But apparently we didn't end up leaving with it. She is. What do you mean? I'm telling you the truth. I completed my task. I retrieved the black box from Pony Station. Looks like the cognito hazards really did a number on her. What are you talking about? I'm fine. Bella, there was no black box in sight when we found you. That's impossible. I'm positive. I, I know I had it in the escape elevator. And there is no escape elevator in Pony Station. None of what, what? you're saying adds up. That's impossible. It's just impossible. Look at me, Bella. Try and focus. What really happened? What really happened? Bella, think carefully. I... 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 Oh. Why'd that scare me so much? No mannequins or anything? Open up. There's a... Doll. Not doll, sorry. Mannequin. There was no black box up here. Oh. My. God. <laughs> oh, these guys are enjoying it! <laughs> That's not what you said. That's not what the subtitle said at all. Imagery and I hate it. I like any type of hanging in imagery. I like. I hate it. Oh, I hate hanging imagery. Check him for what? A fucking pulse? Fuck. Not again. Oh fuck! What do you? What do you expect me to do? Okay, he ran at me really quick. Okay, I thought maybe I had time to look around. And then I saw him zoom at me. <sighs> okay. Oh my god, he runs so fast that you Okay, so what do you expect me to do here? Hold on. I know this is getting annoying. I just juked him out. Hold on. Oh, I just juked him out. Pony Station will have to be locked down. Oh, I juked him out. for certain. That was the point. Oh my God! Your first visit again. Positively brilliant. My hands are shaking now. All right. This experiment. Exciting avenues. Ed. Although some sections stray from the original SCP-701 script, everyone remained perfectly in character. Poorly consumed in the act, the audience too seemed to be entirely observing the performance. A strange thing, though, I noticed certain something, a person, perhaps, appear on the stage. He was not one of our original members, but, well, he was quite reserved, rather friendly. A tribute to Ambassador Alagata. That's it. Must be the truth. The splendid, magnificent truth. Hang the traitors. One and one. Hang the trail. 
In the ignorance, together with the news, hang them all to alert the world. Cheers and cheers all around for our great king. Let us bask in his glory. Together we follow in the blood of the fools we offer to thee, hanged king. The writing that follows is obscured by bloodstains. Okay. So SCP-701 is a script. One performance mm -hmm. and all of Pony Station is ruined. I that's see. That's so cool. I see. That's really cool, though. And then they start attacking everyone. This is some cool storytelling. The whole place went to ruin. It's those mannequins again. Where are they heading? But where have all those volunteers gone? There's no escape elevator. Whoa. Oh my god, I hate it. Holy fuck. I guess this is the ending of their performance. That's what those pages falling from the ceiling are. The Hanged King's tragedy. And it looks like they want one more. Oh, this is cool, though. I serve my king Who's there? with my blood. What the fuck? Hey, guys. Sacrifices head and seek redemption with his blood. Kill him! Kill him! <coughs> what? A despicable usurper does not deserve the glorious, glorious crown. crown. Whoa! Whoa! That's cool. It's the goddamn cognito hazard again. I need to leave right now. Oh, I see. It's making me see these things. Oh, I feel like I'm in like a movie right now. Oh, this is as fast as I can sprint. Good shit, Bella. Was she actually like fighting people when this shit happened? Okay, screw off. I knew you were coming for me. Ow. I still got tackled. Ow. Oh my god, Bella! Bella goes crazy! Bam, bam! Uh, she's absolutely beating someone, actually. She's absolutely actually beating someone up, right? She's killing someone. Then let's go, let's scoot. Look at this, this is dope. For an SCP game, this is just so dope. Not like that deters it from anything, or like ruins its vision, or, or like its quality. This is just cool and it's all right. So special. What am I playing right now? Bam. Thanks, Squire. With my blood, I serve my king. With my blood, 
I serve my king with my blood. I serve my king with my blood. I serve my king with my blood. I serve my king. Oh, whoa. Come on. With my blood, I serve my king. Oh, I stabbed this one. Her condition is unstable. I've just injected her with a sedative, but you need to let her rest for a while. Thanks, doctor. Well, let's go then. What? We haven't found the black box yet. You still don't get it, do you? Get what? What do you mean? A black box is merely a vehicle for recording the truth. But a black box isn't always a black box. You mean... That's right. She is now the black box. Got time for a cold one? Because our work here is done. Whoa. I serve my king with my blood. Blissful suffocation. Sacrifice of sin. The black box has been properly contained at Site 105 and pending further investigation. Above is the full record of the inquiry. Oh my god. Okay, so hold on. 701 Euclid. SCP-701, The Hanged King's Tragedy is a five-act revenge tragedy from the Caroline era. Performances of the play are associated with psychotic and suicidal behavior amongst both audience members and participants, in addition to the his appearance of a mysterious character. SCP-701-1 Historical estimates place the number of lives claimed by the play at between 168 and 173 over the past 300 years. Typical case study of the SCP-701 incident took place on May 27, 2009, during a group test experiment performance. The presiding project research leader at the time was Dr. Tyler Wright Tyler's notes. According to research logs, SCP-701 is a self-revolving mimetic virus that spreads through unknown means via dramatic text. Pony Station is currently under a full-scale lockdown. Archives pertaining to SCP-701 are scattered throughout the site. Translated text. Uh, that's indeed about a question, sir, but according to our investigation of Bell, that data is no longer considered complete. The black box is the only reliable reporting containing the entirety of the research contents. She's a sole complete database of seven. Okay. I feel like this should be the description, right? <coughs> oh, whoa, look at this. Okay, hold on. Performance of the Hanged King's tragedy did not always end with an outbreak of the blank recorded form since only blank 36.78% have ended in SCP-701 events. According, oh, according to historical records and investigations, these outbreaks generally follow the same pattern. Oh, there's so much to read, but it's okay. I like reading it. One or two weeks, seven to 14 days prior to the event, during this dress rehearsal period, cast members will begin to spontaneously deviate from the published text of the play. Rather than improvisation or gaffes associated with going off script, said deviations will be both orderly and consistent as if the actors are working off a new version of the script. The cast and production crew will seem unaware of any change. If it is brought to their attention, they will state that the play has run that way from the beginning. They'll gaslight them. Two to three hours prior to the event, the outbreak generally occurs during opening night or else at a production with the greatest planned attendance, generally falling within the first week after the 
blaze opening. One to two hours before event, SP 701 1 begins to appear on stage in the final scene of Act 1. Generally, in the background or to the side of the main action, it may seem to enter or exit the stage area, but does not appear to ever enter the backstage or offstage area. It simply disappears when not on stage. The cast does not appear to notice or comment on SCP 701 1, at least at first. The event. SCP-701-1 appears fully on stage during the banquet scene in Act 5. Here it will be incorporated into the action of the play as the Hanged King. The cast will either murder each other or commit suicide, sometimes using items that seem to appear spontaneously on stage. Writing breaks out in the audience with viewers randomly attacking everyone in front of them regardless of prior relationship. Following the event. If any of the audience members survive the initial outbreak, they may exit the performance space, in which case they will continue to engage in random or opportunistic violence. Victims will generally require sedation or restraint in this scenario. Normal personality will begin to return roughly 24 hours after the event. Surviving victims will generally exhibit signs consistent with a traumatic experience, somewhere of no recollection of the event. Others may be rendered permanently comatose. Comatose. Sorry. Uh, are psychotic for typical case study outbreaks. The incident report SCP 701 19 blah 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 dash 1. Analysis of the events leading up to the last uncontained SCP 701 event in 19 blank during a high school drama performance. And whoa, for more information on the place, published text. Huh. Oh, I see. I'm like... Okay, I'm entering all the data. Okay. So it is a lot of reading, which again, I'm fine with. That's a lot of what the SCP thing is. Bushkill research on SCP-701 took place on May 19th, 2011 during a group test experiment performance. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, I saw this. Uh... Okay, whatever. In short, SCP-701 is a self-evolving mimetic virus transmitted through unknown means for the text play, yada, yada, yada. Dr. Tyler. Dr. Blank has theorized that SCP-701 events may involve expunged. This hypothesis is consistent with a spike in blank blank levels detected via satellite in the vicinity of the 19 blank incident indicating expands. Foundation agents are understanding orders to suppress any performance or publication of SCP-701 whenever found or detected. Despite our best efforts to the contrary, however, the play remains freely available online, also sometimes under different titles. Really? All attempts to detect or isolate the origin of these copies have failed. Suppression of the play's publication has generally been successful with most copies of a 1971 scholarly ed edition destroyed before distribution. Wow, imagine that. Nonetheless, copies of the 1965 trade Paperback turn up with some regularity in both college and high school libraries. Agents are to obtain or otherwise destroy these items whenever possible. How about you? Okay, hold on. Oh, I see. Special containment priest. I see. All materials relating to SP-701 are to be kept in a triple locked archive at storage site blank. These items are currently consisting of the two currently extant copies of the 1640 quarto, 27 copies of the 1965 trade paperback edition, edition, sorry, 10 copies of 1971 hardcover printing, 21 floppy diskettes consisting of data seized from raids on expunged, one SVHS video cassette tape. Oh, that's what the PowerPoint slideshow we were looking at. That's what it was. It was all this evidence. And one, st yeah, steel knife of unknown origin. I see. At no time are there any of these items to be removed from the room. Access to the area is to be heavily monitored. Absolutely no personnel whatsoever is to be granted access to the archive without the express in person permission of doctors blank, blank, and blank. Removal of these items from the site uh, is 
strictly prohibited without exception. All personnel entering this personnel must be or this area must be placed under strict surveillance. At present, the most complete source of data is preserved in Black Box 701-3. Original name Bella Lawrence. Wow. That's fun. That's crazy. Submit. All right, no tasks. Let's. Okay. Sheesh. That was wild. I loved that. I loved being able to play through the story and then have to, I guess, and then see the data that got from it, that they got from it. That's cool. I like that a lot. <laughs> Let's see. How was the first mission, Carl? I was confused at first, but I got over it. Good. I have to admit, you are no worse than I expected. How about Taco Night for celebration? So, are we really using a living being as a tool to contain anonymous objects? Talking about Bella. Hey, my T boy. If Gint doesn't shut the fuck up, I've seen a great many failed agents. They are prepared to sacrifice themselves at any time in order to complete a task, secure, contain, protect. For them, it is a creed worth paying the ultimate price for. And it is our duty to record all of this truthfully and honestly so that people may remember them forever. I understand. I'm not gonna poke him. Anyway. <laughs> You complete your first mission smoothly, we should celebrate. How about going for a drink? Old place. Count me in. No, not Gint. Yeah, no, let's get drunk. <laughs> How about a taco night? Or donut night? Okay. Celebrate the completion of my first ever archive mission. My colleagues through a small party. I started growing me and my colleagues in this place. I started to really enjoy all of it. Maybe it was all the drinking. I dreamt I was lost in a strange cave. It was dark and damp. It smelled of decay. In the depths of darkness, I saw at all times two red dots monitoring my every move. What a strange dream. Tequila is too strong of a drink. I need an espresso to sober me up. Back on the computer. Okay, well, I'm not gonna hit files yet. Um, in fact, what I'm probably gonna do is, what dare you? Oh, whoa, I didn't even know I could look at some of these. Okay, hold on, let me let me read some of these. sci 6 research is investigated that the growth rate of crops and metabolic rate of human beings within the influencing area increased. Oh, this is investigation, okay. Site 99, a capsule bearing the insignia of the Foundation's Temporal Anomalies Department was discovered near Moody Peak, Nevada. Contents included yet to be written foundation documents and SCP files. Several of the aforementioned SCPs have since been contained. The capsule itself has been transported to temporal site 1 RCT, whatever that is, where if efforts to reverse engineer the device and complete the retro casual loop are ongoing. All right, site 816. Foundation has found an Elbrus computer in a Cold War bunker. The computer is still running and is confirmed to be able to control all missile defense facilities around all Eastern Europe. In power off condition. What the fuck? An incident almost occurred within Site 17 involving SCP 953, who nearly broke out of containment after the assigned drone unexpectedly malfunctioned and jammed the door, leaving a slight gap open. Fortunately, her efforts were thwarted by an American foxhound designated Mr. Kibbles, attracted by the pallet that was being brought in and pouncing right into SCP 953. Mr. Kibbles will be receiving an award ceremony. Oh no, Mr. Kibbles. The head chef of Site 86 have been changed as per the written opinion of Sh Chief Blank. The pizza made by the new head chef is particularly exquisite. Apparently, the flavor changes to match the person eating it. Site scientists develop an inner genetic drug that lets you work without sleeping. What? It is said to let you stay up all night without losing efficiency. What? I want it. Behavior may become slightly wired as a side effect, but it is 
within acceptable levels. At present, O5 is considering making this drug readily available at every site. That's not a bad... I might want to work for SCP. Provisional Site-72 reports that the recent uptick in geological activity was not in any way related to SCP-4997. However, the acting site director would like to remind everyone that they are still accepting reasonable proposals regarding means of neutralization and that kill it with fire is not a reasonable proposal. That must be like a spider or something. No data has been released connected to an incident. To incident 035-A caused by SCP-35, currently contained at site 108. Personnel with a clearance of four or above may access the data by submitting the... Oh, okay. Must have been something pretty bad. A new exploration device has been developed at site 56. Usable even in locations where detection may be difficult it is expected to... Enable communication with the field. It is currently undergoing testing. If no problems are found, it will be distributed to the exploration department. Okay, I think that's where I'm going to end it here. <laughs> I think um, I made a pretty good progress considering I've been playing for about two hours. Oh my god, I'm so, so happy that I played this. This is nothing, 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 nothing like I thought the game would be. Because all that they, sh yeah, all that they let you play was Bella's story, in the beta. So I, I I had no idea it would be something like this. I'm very very happy it is something like this. This is very unique. This is very cool, um, and I really do want to play more of it. Um, and I'll probably play it on stream because I, you probably know I've been playing it on stream. But I do want to thank anyone who came stop by and watch it i probably actually i'm gonna split this into multiple episodes yeah i'll probably split that desert story into episode one and then bella's story into episode two but for those who saw it on the stream yeah see the whole thing one little go um but an edited version um two edited versions that is will be on the channel soon but that's it for the stream guys i am a little tired i do want to show you guys the main menu Huh. What? That's cool. This isn't the main menu I was used to. Oh well. Ooh, okay. Thank you guys for watching. <laughs>